Well, we have got our apron on today because we are at the Art Museum of Myrtle Beach. I'm joined by Colin. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing awesome. Let's go ahead and get into it. What All are right. we doing today? So today we have these stuffed paper sculptures of musical instruments. It's inspired by our exhibit, Lifting Black Voices. We have one of the galleries in the show has an um, entire uh, gallery full of um, paintings and artwork that is inspired by jazz and music. Mm -hmm. So this is a pretty simple project, but still it gives you really cool results. So the first step for this is you're going to print out either some type of musical instrument, it could be whatever you'd like. We have some tubas here. And after you print them out, you're going to cut them out. And then you're going to get another sheet of paper and you're going to trace the outline of the instrument. Okay. So you just go around. And this, it doesn't have to be nice and neat. You can just do it a little quick. You can do a little sketchy, which I like to do. I'm very focused right now. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad you said it didn't have to be perfect. Yeah, sketching it, it takes a lot of focus, more focus than you'd think. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So yeah, once you have that all sketched out, you'll end up cutting it out. Okay. But thankfully, we already have these two examples already cut out. Yay! <laughs> so yeah, so. I can skip that step. Yay. <laughs> okay. So yeah, uh, once you cut them out, you will have, of course, two pieces of paper. And what you want to do is first staple half the papers together. So I did it kind of a little strategic spot so we can still kind of have some areas where we can uh, end up stuffing the paper in there. Uh, but so gotcha. I did some like at the top and I just did some of the sides too, leaving openings at up here and also two here at the bottom as well. But after you get it stapled together, you get to decorate it. And okay. of course this is completely up to the artist how you would want to decorate it using whatever colors, whatever types of patterns. It's completely right. up to you. Let's do it. All right, so the next part is actually stuffing it. Okay. So the best uh, product to use is just using some tissue paper. So all you do is just rip pieces off at a time. And you can scrunch them up a little bit, but you don't want it to get too small though. So mm -hmm. you want them to make sure they actually like fill a lot of the sculpture. Okay. And you just stick them in wherever you have any openings. And with this, you can fill up as much as you want. You do have to be a little careful, though, of not overstuffing mm -hmm. it, however, because then you won't be able to really get it closed at all. I think we're done. I think we are. So, to finish it up, all you gotta do is just take a stapler and just staple it closed. Whatever places you haven't put staples in, just close it all up. It's fun before you staple the whole thing, especially at the top. It's almost like a little birthday gift with the, mm -hmm. the tissue paper. There it is. And there we have it. We have our little stuffed paper sculptures. And little instruments that we can play too. <laughs> I don't know how to hold a tuba. Hold on. I, <laughs> I think it's like that. Perhaps. See, this way, this way, I'll, I'll choose my saxophone. I know how to actually yeah, hold that's, this. Yeah, that's, that's a bit more <laughs> straightforward. Well, thank you so much. This was a blast. Of course, it's my pleasure.